this legendary egg wing. Welcome to my channel. Hey guys, what's going on? Legendary Agwing here, and today I bring you guys the first mod to my channel for Naruto Storm 4. And this mod is the Chinese traditional costume from the Chinese pre-order DLC. So this is pretty much region lock, and you know, only available in China. But for some reason, it was still inside the game files, so I decided to pull it up and make a quick video about it. Uh, the costume itself is not that impressive, and it does come with a few bugs because it's a model swap. But I figured, you know, this brings hope to the modding community for Naruto Storm 4, and let them know that, you know, we should go ahead and get things cracking. Uh, for you guys, if you want to have this little DLC pre order thing just to show off or whatever, or just to use just because it's something new type of uh I'll leave a link in the description, and all you have to do is just drop it into your directory. Really simple, turn on your game, and he'll be on Storm 2 Naruto. So, yeah, that's cool. Um, with that being said, um, enjoy the rest of this video gameplay, and I'll have another video out pretty soon. Peace. Oh, and shout out to Johnny Life for getting this footage for me. I really appreciate it, dude. Thanks for working with me. I got more videos coming for you guys soon. Stay tuned. It's on. Hey guys, what's going on? Legendary Ag Wang here, and today I want to discuss what's going on with my channel and why I haven't been putting out Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm for footage. Now, yesterday I've come across a bug that's been going around the Steam PC Naruto community, and it causes our game to run at really low frame rates. It started off at like around like five frame rates, where you know we could. 